Well, Toy Story star and open Republican Tim Allen hasn't been quiet about his thoughts on the woke insanity that is plaguing our culture. And now he's causing the left to have an absolute meltdown, taking to Twitter, saying, who is the face of woke? Do wokies have a clubhouse in someone's backyard or maybe a cute yet safe playpen somewhere? This past June, Tim Allen took a swipe at Disney's pro-LGBTQ programming when he tweeted about his latest trip to California. Took some kids to Disneyland and overheard a 13-year-old boy wondering if he may be pansexual since he loves skillets. Uh, supporters of his are having a field day with his tweets. And here to discuss more is actor, filmmaker, and musician John Schneider. <laughs> John, great to have you. And we're definitely going to talk about your brand new movie because I can't wait to hear all about it. But I've got to you. get your thoughts. I've got to get your thoughts on the wokeness that is play plaguing Hollywood. Well, I loved I love Tim Allen. Hollywood is such a strange place. They think we're all stupid. They really do. They think that we all owe our souls, and I mean you and me and everybody who watches anything, that we all owe our souls to the company store for some reason. They, they forget that it's the audience that pays their salaries for their cinchy jobs. So lately, they've, been, they've managed to brand exclusion as inclusion, right? They are preaching really division under the guise of unity. And we're smarter than that. So I, I applaud Tim Allen for pointing out what he points out. But folks need to remember that Tim is a comedian. Okay? Let's not forget Richard Pryor. Let's not forget Don Rickles. Let's not forget Lenny Bruce. And certainly, let's never forget George Carlin. It seems to me that when these comedians went on to their reward. This whole group of Hollywood was like, oh, thank God, we can finally be so uptight that we can make everybody as uptight as we are. Uh, and it, and it's, it's lunacy. So uh, I, applaud, I applaud Tim. I think he did a great job. I think uh, 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 if somebody identifies as a frying pan, then <laughs> they need help. Gosh darn it. Or, well, yeah, right? you're right. Then that's another problem, right? Uh, all right, John. That's a whole other, <laughs> that's a whole other problem. We'll get no you back cure, and talk I'm about afraid. that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, John. The new movie you have coming out tomorrow called "To Die For." Tell us about it. "To Die For" is about our flag. It is a uh, unapologetically patriotic film. With uh, I play this man you're seeing right here, who drives around with a flag on the back of his truck, which we're seeing more and more in in uh, rural America, by the way who goes to jail rather than adhere to a restraining order telling him he can't do that. So in, in John Schneider's life, uh, the only weapons I have, the, my weapons of choice in this arena, I'm a firm believer in the Second Amendment, but my weapons of choice in my, my field are my inspiration, my laptop, and my camera. So my friends and I made this film over the last uh, over the last 10 months so that people could be invited into conversation about yeah. freedom and the flag and what it really means to be an American before the midterm election. That's mm. why it comes out tomorrow. Yeah. And John, where can where can people see this movie? You can go to to die. Excuse me. To die for movie okay. dot com. comes out at 1201 tonight oh, to fantastic. die for movie. Dot com and you can stream it. It'll be for sale on Orange Friday, which in honor of the General Lee, my car from the Dukes of Hazard, is of course <laughs> the day, the oh, Friday right. after Thanksgiving. All right, uh, John Schneider, you'll always be Do Bo Duke to me. Uh, so great Thank to have you, you here with well. us. Thanks and good luck on the movie. <laughs> I identify as a frying pan. That's just uh, All right, you, you, take some, care. you get some help Thank for you, that. Thank you, everybody. Okay. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. No crooked, crooked establishment. establishment. None of that twisting, twisting the truth. truth. No talking down don't to me. Don't tell me how to think. Don't tell me how to think. Don't tell me how to think. I trust Newsmax. Newsmax. They don't tell, tell me how, how to think. think. They let, let me decide. Newsmax. Real news. For real people.